Meet the GMK Tech Evo X2, a game-changing mini PC that takes compact performance to a whole new level. This powerhouse is among the first to feature AMD's revolutionary Strix Halo platform, bringing desktop class capabilities to a sleek, portable design. At the heart of the Evo X2 is AMD's Ryzen AI 9 Max Plus 395 APU, a 16-core, 32-thread beast with a max boost clock of 5.1 GHz. With 80 MB of cache and an NPU capable of 50 tops, this machine is built for AI-driven applications, gaming, and demanding workloads. But that's not all. The integrated Radeon 8060S iGPU packs 40 compute units, delivering a performance leap that rivals discrete graphics cards. Whether it's gaming, 3D rendering, or video editing, the Evo X2 delivers stunning visuals and smooth performance. Memory and storage? You've got options. The Evo X2 supports up to a massive 128GB of LPDD5X RAM, ensuring seamless multitasking. With 2TB of high-speed SSD storage, you'll have more than enough space for games, creative projects, and professional applications. Under the hood, the Strix Halo platform allows for a configurable TDP between 45 watt and 120 watts, with peak power consumption reaching 140 watts. This means serious performance when you need it and efficiency when you don't. Connectivity is top notch with support for Wi Fi 7 and Bluetooth 5.3, giving you ultra fast wireless speeds and seamless device pairing. Whether it's gaming, streaming, or work, expect zero compromises. With a price tag of around $2,000, the Evo X2 is one of the most premium mini PCs on the market. It's a high-end device for power users who demand the absolute best. GMK Tech is among the first to bring Strix Halo to mini PCs, setting the stage for the future of compact computing. But the question remains, is this the ultimate mini PC or will competitors rise to the challenge? What do you think of the GMK Tech Evo X2? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more tech updates. Thanks for watching. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side.